Converting a Word file to an Excel file requires a few steps. And first, we're going to go ahead and open up Word and look at our document and see some ways that we can make this a little bit easier for Excel to import it. Now first, let's go ahead and under our Word document, we're going to reveal the paragraph marks by going to the Home tab, and then selecting the Formatting tool. So we'll click on that. Now you'll see we have these paragraph marks that show up every time we end a paragraph. Next, underneath the Home tab still, let's go over to the right and above the Editing section, we're going to click on Replace. Then let's click on More. And under Find What, under Replace, we'll click on Special and select Paragraph Mark. Click on that, you'll see it will add a little extra option here. And let's replace that with something that's easily identifiable that we know is specific to us. So let's select the tilde key. It's right underneath the escape key. And if we hold down the shift and hit the tilde, we'll get that little squiggly mark. Now let's click replace all. And it says that we found four of these instances. And click OK. And click out of this by selecting the close icon. Scroll up. Now if we turn off the formatting, hide all those options, we'll see everything's changed just a little bit. Now let's click on File, Save As, and underneath the Word document, let's select that and click on Plain Text. And let's save this as Lorem 3 and click Save. Now it's going to look at some conversion options. Let's just go with the defaults and click OK. Great. Now let's close out of Word. And underneath Excel, let's go to File, click on File, and click on Open. And we'll navigate to the desktop, click on that. And instead of all Excel files, let's click on that drop down menu and select Text Files. Now we'll see our text file opens up. Let's click on Lorem 3 and click Open. Now we'll have some options here. Since we're prepared, let's go ahead and click on Delimited and click Next. And here under Delimiters, let's go ahead and click on Other and enter our tilde key. Because now we have a specific element that we're going to search for that's going to break out each individual paragraph and click Next, and then click Finish. Now we'll see that all three of our paragraphs have been separated into each individual cell. One, two, and three. And that's how you convert a Word document to Excel.